Imagine if an atom was the size of a grain of sand. That same grain of sand would be 250 meters wide. That's five Olympic swimming pools lined up. Atoms are the fundamental building blocks of matter. In the heart of an atom, you have a core called a nucleus, made with positively charged protons and neutrons with no charge. Around the atom are negatively charged electrons. What's an electron? You know how a battery has a positive side and a negative side too? Electrons have a negative charge that makes up electricity. Sometimes it behaves like a wave, sometimes it behaves like a ball. An electron is a fundamental particle, meaning you can't break it down. An electron is a lot smaller than a proton. What's a proton? A proton is a subatomic particle with a positive charge. It is found in the nucleus of an atom, along with neutrons. Protons determine the atomic number of an element. There are quarks bound together by a strong nuclear force. Protons are involved with chemical reactions and electricity. What's a neutron? A neutron is a particle found in the nucleus of an atom. It has no electric charge. Neutrons are about the same size as protons. They play an important role in nuclear fission and fusion. When you mix protons, electrons, and neutrons in different combinations, you get different flavors of atoms. Some are stable, some are dangerous, some are very, very dangerous, and some will kill you if you are found without it. The difference between a stable element and a very, very dangerous one can be very small. Thanks for watching this Quantum Kid video. I really missed making these. Please support us by liking, subscribing, and sharing this video with friends and family. Thanks for watching again. See you guys in the next episode. Peace.